Well, new at 6, the mayor in Malden is causing quite a bit of a stir, claiming that winter is now over. Now, I mean, it has been such a it mild has. season that the mayor tweeted that the city will lift all winter parking restrictions. But is it really over? Meteorologist Jacob Wyckoff gives us his take. We never know what's going to happen between now, St. Patrick's Day, even April. We've had snow in April, so I don't believe it's over, no. Is winter done? I don't even know if winter's begun, truthfully, because it still feels like spring out here. Like, I, we're, we're in February right now, and I keep asking myself, has winter started? Because, you know, they say winter is coming, but I haven't seen it. Do you think, because it's been a slow winter, that winter's going to end in a harsh way? It could. It could. We're in New England. It could. Are you looking forward towards spring, or are you just waiting for the next big snowstorm? I'm looking towards spring. It's kind of been really cold lately. I'm ready for spring. I'm ready for St. Patrick's Day. I'm ready for Ma March Madness. I'm ready for the Red Sox. So is the mayor right? Is winter officially done? We're coming off the heels of one of our warmest Januaries on record. In fact, we are in fifth place for the warmest January on record. It's been a almost record warm winter, and so that's translated into measly snow totals. Only about eight inches thus far for the season. Our snowiest month, February, only a trace of snow. We've had some cold last Saturday, setting records below zero. Tomorrow, we may set some record warm temperatures, but looking ahead, the next 8 to 14 days, looks like some warmth will build in, and that takes us right on into March. We've had some big March and April storms. Everyone remembers that April Fool's Day storm over two feet of snow. March 13, 2018, over a foot of snow. The good news is if we get those March and April snowstorms, the sun angle does its job, melts all of it away pretty quickly, so we've got that going for us. So is winter officially done? We shall see. In the studio, Jacob Wyckoff, WBZ News. Okay, so that was great. Gives people a lot to talk about. But I think if you've lived in New England long enough, yep. going to back to the beginning of that piece, even if you kind of want it to be over, you're afraid to expect that it's yes. over. We yeah. know better. Well, you know, taking away like a parking ban, there's nothing imminent. There's nothing in the forecast next sure. 10 days or getting later in the month. So you can always implement one short fuse type of a thing. To me, I mean, when you get to the end of February, I know it snows in March and we yeah. get cold days in March. Right. March isn't a winter month to me. It's the yeah. start of climatological yeah. spring. The sun's higher. There's tons of daylight. It's just not winter anymore. We're almost halfway through February, and what you showed us for long-range forecasts, it doesn't yeah. look like we got Mild. any winter. Yeah. There's actually, there is a measure. It's like an accumulated winter severity index. It kind of takes into account your cold days, your ice, your snow, yada, yada. This has been the most mild winter ever recorded in the Boston area. Wow. All right. Up to this okay. point. So winter's over. Yep. <laughs> the Molden Mayor Remind me has of that made in the so. two-foot snowstorm in March that we'll yeah. be covering. <laughs> I am sure, sure positive that we're going to get a burst of cold and some snow in March this year. Usually these mild winters, they, they tend to fight back a little bit at the end.